We know in life, second chances and new opportunities, well, they're a necessity. In the sports world, well, they can mean the difference between a long, successful career or a flame out. Well, the mission's Lucas Ersig knows that all too well. And Benny Vincetta has his story. Two outs here in the second. And Woodford's 1-0 on the way. High fly ball right field. I think he got that thing. To be honest, I don't, I don't know where I would be. But, uh, yeah, baseball is, uh, that's my life right now. I don't think I would be anywhere near a baseball field if I didn't, you know, find it when I was younger. Lucas Ursaig grew up with an alcoholic mother and a strained relationship with his father. Baseball was his. For me, it was just to, you know, get away from everything else in life and just, uh, you know, be in my happy place. This will be a payoff pitch that is on the way. I think I was in English class when I got the results for my SAT and I saw that I had passed that and I literally screamed yes. And I ended up getting kicked out of class because it was like reading time. Sadly, though, his joy of attending California Berkeley was short lived. The college life got the best of Lucas. To have them just work their butts off to try and get me into Cal and then for me to just let them down like that, it's one of the worst feelings anybody could ever have. I remember, you know, sitting next to my mom and having having to tell her that I was, you know, transferring and she started crying and it was just, uh, it was a mess. Lucas transferred to an NAIA school and with priorities in order, selected by the Brewers in the second round of the 2016 MLB Draft. It's a second opportunity and I'm making sure I'm taking every every step possible towards uh, you know getting to my next my next goal and that's the big leagues. No sport parallels life quite like baseball. It's about each new opportunity. It's about a do-over and that was Lucas. It's not only a testament that I proved to myself but to you know everyone else that didn't really have faith in me. I was probably one of the lowest points in my life and and now I'm here and it's awesome.